tuning into Black and White Sports on YouTube. The no holds barred truth on sports. The main event starts now. Well, guys, we need to talk about the Tampa Bay Buccaneers and Tom Brady here in this video. Because, folks, we are now witnessing something that we have not seen from a Tom Brady team in decades. And I literally do mean decades, folks. The Tampa Bay Buccaneers played on the road against the Carolina Panthers, who came in with a one and five record. A one and five record. We were on Sports Wars and um, all of us actually picked the Buccaneers. Felt pretty comfortable about that. Even though I didn't like the line, the line was uh, Tampa Bay by 13 points. I thought that was way too many points. But I thought that the Tampa Bay Buccaneers would actually win this game. Folks, I was dead wrong. The Tampa Bay Buccaneers offense is dead. It is over. This team, folks, as you can see here, they scored a grand total of three points. Three points. A Tom Brady team now is under 500 for the first time this late in the season since 2002. 20 years. This, this is just unbelievable, guys, that um, this offense is this anemic. And guys, Tom Brady, he hasn't looked like himself the entire season. Now, he's only thrown one interception. Tom Brady is not throwing pits. He's not uh, really turning the ball over that much. They are just way, way out of sync. The one in five Carolina Panthers just beat down the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Nobody thought that the Panthers were good. They're not good. The Carolina Panthers are pathetic. But you mean to tell me that the Buccaneers couldn't even score one single touchdown against this team? 21 to 3, the final score. Now, the Buccaneers still in first place because um, that division is trash. Uh, the NFC, still not that good. Green Bay lost today, too. They're probably going to be 3 and 5 because they actually got to play um, at uh, Buffalo next Sunday night. But I'm stunned by this, folks. I am really, really stunned that a Tampa Bay. Buccaneers team led by Tom Brady is sitting at three and four. And they are struggling, absolutely struggling to score points. I can't believe this. Look at the drives here. First quarter, punt, punt, punt. Second quarter, punt, halftime. Then punt, uh, turnover on downs, punt. Finally, you got a field goal. Turnover on downs, and then the game is over. Now, throughout the season, we've seen a team that can actually move the ball. But they can't do anything right in the red zone. A Tom Brady team cannot get the ball in the end zone. What an embarrassment. I mean, what's going on? Tom Brady, we know he has all these problems off the field. Uh, Giselle is probably somewhere right now. Laughing right now. Because, you know, they're actually going through a divorce right now. She wanted him to retire. And uh, Rhodes said that um, Tom Brady is probably having second thoughts about actually um, coming back. He didn't come back to this. Obviously not. But my goodness. You can't score a touchdown. Against the Panthers. There's real problems over there in uh, Tampa Bay. And, of course, uh, Tom Brady was getting backlash, you know, for going to uh, Robert Kraft's um, wedding on a uh, Saturday. He actually missed the walkthrough of the previous game that they lost. The only good win that uh, Tampa Bay has right now is over the Dallas Cowboys, and that was actually in uh, week one at Dallas. And Dallas is uh, good right now. They're um, they're five and two. What, what, what's their right? No, they're four and two. Something like that. Five and two, four and two. I, I'm I'm lost right now as far as the standings go. Uh, but let's actually go over there. Let's check out the standings here. Because we can actually see 
where um Tampa Bay and uh, the Cowboys actually stand in the NFC. So here we go. Philadelphia sits to know Dallas is five and two. So I was right. They're five and two. But look, Tampa Bay is in first place because that division is trash. They sit at three and four. The NFC is wide open, folks. Green Bay, three and four. Minnesota, Minnesota is on five and one right now. And uh, San Francisco is actually playing the Chiefs right now. They were up last time I checked. A lot of mediocre teams in um, the NFC. It's still wide open. But boy, I never thought I would actually see a Tom Brady team. Tom Brady led the league in touchdown passes with the last two seasons. He's nowhere near that. He ha- he only has eight TD passes on the season. Eight. Through seven games. Tampa Bay can do nothing right. I mean, this isn't uh, Peyton Manning on his last list. Tom Brady's still much better than that. This isn't Brett Favre in his last season. Tom Brady's still very, very careful with the football, but he can't score points. That That's the real concern right there. The Bucks defense is good enough to uh, keep you in games. And for the most part, they were still in this game. But man, they have got to get this together. But that's just my thoughts on this. What do you guys think of this? Black and white sports two fans. Let's so stick about all this in the comments. Make sure to subscribe to the channel. And we will catch you next time. Thanks for watching the show. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Be sure to tune in next time on Black and White Sports.